Well, Anna, September was a great month, uh, kicking off season with Active Aging Week, but October, we start another very busy week. We welcome residents back from up north or wherever else they may have been. And we're going to start October off with Living Well. Now, that's a class that I organized many years ago. Mm -hmm. And we're going to start October 3rd with Living Well. And residents are welcome to attend that class. And what it is, is as you know, you've led it many times. We're going to welcome them in um, a discussion on various health topics, nutrition, wellness, fitness, and many residents bring articles, recipes, mm -hmm. and topics they wanted to discuss. Yes. So they're welcome to do that on October 3rd. Well, that's always a good time, Michelle, because it gives the residents an opportunity to talk with us about what's on their mind concerning um, wellness and all its different aspects, any aspects of LifeQuest. And we try to um, allow lots of time for them to bring their ideas, um, things that concern them, and uh, maybe things that they would like to address just on their own. So, yeah, okay. it's a good time. Absolutely. And then, of course, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Yes. And we're going to be welcoming the Lee Health Breast Cancer Nurse Navigator here on October 8th okay. to do a presentation regarding signs, symptoms of breast cancer for women and men. And that's going to be an interesting and very informative program for mm. our residents. And that's going to be on October 8th at 11 o'clock over at the Woodlands in the Grand Cypress. Should be really informative. It will be, absolutely. And then, of course, our physical therapy department, this is right up the fitness alley, um, they're going to be holding a presentation called Posture Alignment and Fall Prevention. One of our Great. physical therapists from over in rehab mm -hmm. will be sharing how we can improve our posture and how our residents can really uh, decrease their fall risks by um, exercises they could do in terms of you know incorporating better posture mm -hmm. and alignment of the spine. That's great, and you know our fitness department is equally as concerned about that. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking forward to hearing what they have to say. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, me too. Yeah. That's on October 11th. Perfect. Perfect. What do you have coming up? Well, one thing that I wanted to uh, bring up from the fitness department was um, we have another wellness on the move That's right. uh, coming up. And for the residents that attended wellness on the move last time, they came back pumped and they came mm -hmm. back asking us, right? That's right. Um, Would you do it again? Would you do it again? And so better weather is coming, mm -hmm. more opportunity for that. And so on October the 24th, uh, the Suzy Q will depart at 9.30. Of course, we'll have an earlier meet time for that. We'll be gone all day. And this one is called uh, Beach Boot Camp at Bowditch, all the bees. And I uh, will be down there with uh, two of our fitness coordinators. And uh, of course, you'll be there. That's right. And we'll be going out to lunch this time, I think. For the I first think. time, we're going to be going over to the Pink Shell. It's just a very Perfect. short walk from where we will be doing Beach Boot Camp. Mm -hmm. And it's called Bongos at sh at pink shell mm -hmm. and our residents Perfect. can order whatever they want on the menu. It's That's outdoor, nice. alfresco, lunch, dining, so that'll Perfect. be different. And I want to also highlight two um, new classes that we have coming up. Nancy yes. D'Amico, one of our um, residents who you know very well, mm -hmm. she's going to be coming back to teach ballroom dance again. Great. For the, I think the third time yes. and she really wants to share with residents that she's going to be teaching three different classes. The first class is ballroom beginner. This is for someone who is never taken a class. Mm -hmm. They may have danced before, um, but brand new to instruction. Okay. And then she's going to be teaching a beginner intermediate for those residents who have taken with her before Okay. and who have knowledge and basic steps mm -hmm. and um, moves and a little bit of choreography. And then the third class she is teaching is for those who are a little more advanced with dancing in ballroom. It's a Latin Nice, not Latin rhythms. So That's Latin great. rhythms, mm -hmm. it's more of an aerobic, so they're going to be moving a little bit more. So those start uh, mid-October. Our residents can check that out in the Shell Point Life if they're Perfect. interested. And she really uh, loves teaching these classes she because does. residents who go on cruises, 
especially mm -hmm. they want to get up and dance during the cocktail Absolutely. hours or the fun time the fine times that they're having there mm -hmm. on the cruise ship and they want to dance so yeah Nancy wants to do that we have a new class and our residents can read more about that class um, and specifically in the in the Shell Point Life October issue but it's called Indoor Cycle oh uh, yeah <laughs> and we have residents who are really loving Indoor Cycle mm -hmm. some who've never even heard of it some who've been taking it for years mm -hmm. other places but we now have it here coming this summer we had seven bikes graciously donated by the Sharp Family Foundation, nice. Phyllis and Bart Sharp. And Ingrid Oliver handles these classes. Mm -hmm. She conducts them. And then right now we're doing Monday through Thursday, four days a week of That's indoor great. cycle in the morning. Um, so those are some more fit plans that we have yeah. for October. What else is coming up? Oh my goodness. So I see that we have a workshop coming up on sciatica, yes. I guess, and back pain mm -hmm. and that kind of thing. And so um, I see that Dr. Uh, Harcourt That's is right. going to be mm -hmm. conducting that workshop. So there is a, a lot that we can do from a fitness standpoint if somebody does have that diagnosis mm -hmm. and their doctor gives them the okay to come in and work with a personal trainer. Um, we are all uh, qualified to help people um, strengthen their low back, their core, all of that. So in tandem with Dr. Harcourt and um, the physical therapy department giving their workshop, you know, then they can come to us and we can help them. We have so many things planned for October. I want to highlight just a few more and talk to you about a few more. Medicare D update. Okay. That is with Joy Darnell. She's going to be leading this program. She does every October to share with the residents um, any changes mm -hmm. to their Medi Medicare D plan okay. will be at this program in um, in October, mid-October. But our walking group, we have a resident walking group that meets once a month on, I believe, the second Saturday of the month. Okay. And they're reconvening in October. They're coming back, the cooler months are here, and they are starting their very first walk of the season, October 13th. And um, they're going to Venetian Bay and Clam Pass over oh, North nice. Naples. And they want to invite all residents who are fit, active, experienced walkers who mm -hmm. want to walk three, or six miles. Oh, nice. That's to, a good walk. That is a long walk, and they want to ask a new resident who's interested in, in maybe meeting new people, having some fun, and mm -hmm. seeing new places. They can join the walking group. Now, Jerry Bishop is the sign-up for that of Eagles Preserve. Okay. Great. And the residents, it's important to know that they all carpool. So they need to be sure to get in touch with Jerry in advance. And oh, then we absolutely. have the sign-up information for that as absolutely. well. Absolutely. Good. Yeah, That's and, great. And it, one last thing I want to talk mm -hmm. about, one of my favorite events um, every single year is the Walk to End Alzheimer's. Yes. As you know, uh, Shell Point participates in three uh, walks each year, and this one is the annual walk that we do every year, and that's October 27th. Yes. And this is for a great cause because mm -hmm. our community thrift store actually donates the registration fees for Shell Point residents, mm -hmm. staff, and our families to attend. So nice. It's so nice. I know there's a couple members of the fitness team that'll be out there mm -hmm. walking alongside the residents and um, just showing our support for um, finding a, an end to that disease. Mm -hmm. um, we know that Alzheimer's affects so many people um, here, not just in Florida and at Shell Point, but all over the world. Right. So it's definitely worth getting out there and showing support and raising awareness. So. And our residents, if they're interested in riding together on a Shell Point bus, they need to sign up. Yes. They could drive down on their own if they wish, mm -hmm. but I know the uh, staff and family, they we meet them all down there. Yeah, it's great. walk together wearing our Shell Point shirts in just really um, promote Shell Point mm -hmm. spirit in our community. Mm -hmm. So that's Sounds October good. 27th, uh, bright and early 8 a.m. Sounds good. Anything else you would like to add about fitness? Oh, goodness. Right now, I mean, I know that we're going into October with um, a lot of energy because we have added nine classes to our fitness schedule, and our new schedule comes out on shellpoint.net. And um, I would want to encourage residents to go ahead, get on shellpoint.net the very last part of September, download that schedule, put it up on the fridge, get involved mm -hmm. in the classes. We have all levels classes, which 
is exactly what it sounds like. If you've never been in a fitness class, any of the all levels classes are perfect for you. You want to try something new. We've got intermediate classes and we have advanced classes. All the information is on the fitness schedule for that. So we'll be running 44 classes every week here at Shell Point beginning October 1st all the way through season. I'm not really sure another gym no. or wellness center can boast that, mm -mm. you know, so that's no. a lot. It is a lot. It's a lot of fun yeah. and we have a fabulous staff. We do. And we love working with you and talking about our ideas and expanding the program, so it's all good. We've come a long way. Yeah, we have. We've got so much more so farther to go, so yeah. we'll look forward to that. And if you're interested in any of these October wellness or fitness programs, please be sure to see the October Shell Point Life magazine or like Anna mentioned, you can always go on showpoint.net to find out the latest updates and information on any programming. And you can contact us mm -hmm. as well. Other than that, stay well, Shell Point, and we'll see you soon.